this first of all is my expression of this movie <laughs> I, I thought it could get better but we're gonna jump straight down to it so we can jump into the goody goody you had ahsoka in her astral plane with with your boy anakin trying to say that during this war that what if i don't want to take and fight and as he explicitly explained well then you're gonna die that's the first thing that leads off, which is great, that bring us into this new part. Then you have the three mothers that is somehow the mothers of this other witch. And then, of course, we have Ezra, face reveal. You know, the dude that everybody's been crying about. Okay, we get to find out who he finally is. And um, Morgan, of course, becoming one of the mother witches, apparently. She got initiated in. And, of course, we have... Um, our zombified stormtroopers. I guess they're doing a throwback from Star Wars. So, yeah. <laughs> you have to wrap it all up. Balin tell his apprentice to fight the other two <laughs> apprentice Jedi's, and she had the most exclamation of, "Well, by myself." That was. <laughs> and then at the end, Balin leaves to go off on this journey to this certain location where it, uh, apparently the entire Jedi force. Saga continues, so he. <sighs> so, how do we feel about this? We was burglarized on this picture. I, nah. Let's just get down to it. <sighs> I just. No, <laughs> oh, oh, this was my expression. This was me. This was me. Uh -oh. This was, it was the grimace I had on my face as I had to endure <laughs> almost four hours of that mess. Was it four hours? Maybe it was 30 minutes each. No, it was like 40 minutes. Four hours. Yeah, it was like 2.30, but the rest Wait. was like 40. So yeah. Dude, Too long. It's like, what, what are we, like, how do we even begin? We're trying to get like tighter in our conversation, but it just, Sabine acting still sucked. Just acting just, just sucked. Uh, like I said, she went to this astral plane and she, I mean, that, that part was understanding about her trying to be kind of this, almost like she's trying to go against what Anakin became in terms of Darth Vader, yeah. and she don't want to fight in this war, and he's basically trying to say, you're trying to fight this war to prevent hopefully future um, Jedi from having to fight this war so they can really, you know, won't have to be soldiers. They can actually do, be defenders of what they're supposed to be. So that was good, but you know, as we know, Sabine got captured, so I don't know the, the, the <laughs> acting. I don't know why when she came to, she was laying in the water as if she just couldn't move. <laughs> they yeah, had I, to jump in the water I, to get her, pull her out and lay her on it. That was just like crappy directed, crappy right. And then somehow to get on the ship and they find some magical whales. Somehow. <laughs> I'm Hold on, you got you guys forget she didn't even she didn't even cough up the water. She just got up there and just opened her eyes, good to go. <laughs> like she was down there for like hours. <laughs> just just chilling. I was like <laughs> she touched the wheel when they went to leave the planet to find out since they didn't know what the coordinates was. So the wheel somehow was just it's supposed to have been like a wheel graveyard with a wheel just I guess for whatever reason, they just travel back and forth between the things. So the whales just knew where to go. And so it's, he just had her to touch the whale, use a so-called force. And then when the little robot was asking her, like, where are we going? I don't know. I guess we're just going to go along with the ride and see what happens. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like Did they just go roll? Oh. Like, <laughs> we're just going to go for the ride. Okay. Great. And so okay. Then, and then you jump into General Throne. He finally makes his appearance. Some blue skin, red eyed, you don't even get intimidated yes. when looking at him type guy. He's supposed to be scary, all right. <laughs> I, don't, I don't, I was just like, he gave just, off a trick more than scary. Just, he just, they just, they painted this man blue. <laughs> <laughs> right. A couple red eyes, you know. <laughs> and then how can we forget the three mothers who suddenly appeared? So they just, we're just gonna hold them the three Macbeth witches. That's <laughs> You're right. <laughs> With these little so orbs, they, they had the orb, the same one they destroyed. So they, I'm, I'm trying to speed through this. So they basically changed the, the Morgan into one of them, give her some kind of magical sword. Ahsoka arrives, blah, blah. They find, as, as 
uh then they said they find uh Ezra and then the Ezra. acting between <laughs> that is so trashy. Cringe. Well, he trying to, you ain't seen somebody in that many years, try to talk to him, then you get withdrawn. Well, well tell me about, well, I, said, I, don't, I don't want to talk about, it. I, it's just my first time seeing you. I just want to take him, to be happy that, no, it's going on. Like, we don't have time for you to sit up there and go into this girly, insecure, withdrawn. Well, I just want to enjoy this moment. Well, listen, you're just being chased, attacked. Listen, we got to get off this island. We got other people, I mean, off this, this planet. We got other people here. We got other uh, Jedi's who are mercenaries. We got this General Throne. Like, tell him a foot. Uh-uh. They want to just go on, on, on a ride and escapade with these little turtle creatures. I don't yeah. even get it. <laughs> <laughs> and that was then reuniting. Ahsoka shows up as they being attacked. But just try, attack, jump, whatever, all this crap. And then they were about to take out because they got this big old uh, uh, Empire battle cruiser. So they were docking to get, well, we still don't know what they was getting. Something they were teleport, transporting into the ship. And they were supposed to take off. And so throughout this whole thing, Hollywood appears. I know y'all don't know about <laughs> Hollywood. He's the, he's, the, he's the directing force that just make things happen to make it just seem like everything just... Paying out good and in, in, in the face of good. So this general, at the upper hand, they way out there, they ship doesn't crash. They somehow get on these little riding animals. They just call them beasts of burden. I don't know what the heck they right. call them. And they That's somehow crazy. run down before he take off on the ship. Somehow is able that magically that Sabine now can use the force to such a great degree though she couldn't move a cup four episodes ago. Right. Right, just but randomly. They are, and, and you got the little crappy ears and he using his full, and it's just lame, direct, just crap. <laughs> that was so funny. You, there, you got the zombified storm, stormtroopers. You got the Morgan Witch with now this other new blade that sh lights up green. She fighting Ahsoka. I Balin, he done left his apprentice to go on some search for something. And then... At the end of the day, he would the the, the guy just whining in to me. I just want to get home. I don't I... know what that was about. <laughs> so she somehow used right. her extraordinary force to push him on the ship as they were sitting on the cliff and the, and the Empire battle crews are taking off. Somehow he was like, I can't make this jump. Yes, you can. So this idiot jumped and she used her force to, to push him in. <gasps> she couldn't, mind you, she couldn't move a cup, but I guess the power of friendship. Gave her I, all the force she needs. <laughs> it was so, like, go on, baby. Yeah. Go on. Go on. Go on. No, it, bro, when I tell you, I it was the only redeeming episode was when Anakin came back to freaking put like put her in perspective that this is war. Like, what are you doing? After that, I don't even know. They tried to force the father-daughter scene, I mean, with the master-student scene with him and her, and he's like, yeah, they're Jedis, but I trained you better than that. With the same training that the Jedis use, sir? Okay, cool. And like you said, we get Ezra, and here she go with, I just I just want to enjoy the moment. He Even he was like, you do know we got to go back, right? Like, this man is tired, okay? He's tired of being here. He ready to go home, and you're trying to be cool. <laughs> then, then when he said, where's the soul? She was like, no, if you think she did this, I think she did. Like, what would she do? He's a Jedi. He understands. Like, she might have not lived. Ain't it? Just, uh, where's the okay. stuff? Okay. What? Okay. Can you rip the band aid? <laughs> and then I look at when he returns, and I'm guessing that, oh, yeah, let's not forget the Jedi kid, who I guess is Ezra's son, who somehow can, oh, I can hear, Mama. I can hear the light. Can't you hear the light? Out of nowhere. Out of nowhere, he was just he, he was doing the final soak, and he's like, I feel something, mom. Where did you come from? How you was no use out of all this time. So, you telling me before now, you just never knew. He okay, cool, all right, but you're gonna throw it in there. So, I'm guessing <laughs> Ezra was supposed to be the general, the green general. I guess they hooked up. I guess that's his. Son. I'm guessing because they, they when they look at him, they don't look at each other at the end. And I'm like, if that was like your, I mean, maybe she had like I said, maybe she hooked up with somebody else and she just felt guilty and she's like, oh, you're back. Oh well. Uh. <laughs> and he, so since we're here, they just sit there and look at each other, ain't it? And then and that's how we end. And it's like kind of like, oh no, no, yeah, then you know, oh, we got I, I say Bean is able to kind of feel the presence of Anakin as he just somehow that was stupid. I don't even know why the end that that was trash. Right? Why is he keep popping up? He just at the end. Sorry, we need help. We don't need no smirking. Okay, we need to... <laughs> He's just watching them like... <laughs> we're going to cut a show. We don't even go to... That's it. That's... Don't... The pop... 
is not popping. <laughs> <Yeah, Lee. laughs> this is the face you would have after this. Show. You would be looking like this, and then gonna have the audacity to make a season two. That right? That writer who the heck wrote this mess? Hold on, y'all. Just give me a little time. I gotta look, take off the hater block. I've got, I got, I got, I don't finish hating enough on this show. <laughs> no more hating. Oh my God. I, I'm, I'm, I'm done with it. Uh, you guys. Oh my goodness. You just, How... you just couldn't. Who is just what the creator Dave Filoni? Stop it. Don't, Stop. don't write anything yet. No, don't not make us. No, no, just, just. No, no. Like the user review said, one of the user reviews said, another forgettable waste of time. It's just exactly that, that that wraps it up. So, like, that's it. That's it. We're, we're not going to stretch this out long. We're going to keep it so that y'all can enjoy it. But the popcorn is not popping. Uh, you can <laughs> pull out Smeagol or Golem, whatever you want to call it. And yes, you, we, your time will be stolen. It was stolen. So, that's it. <laughs> we're wrapping up. This is Alex Big Unk. Nene, Queen of Hearts. <laughs> Signing off. The, the popcorn is not popping. We tried to get y'all some kernels. That's all you getting. <laughs> That's it. Please, please just remember to like, subscribe, and comment. We can't go through this by ourselves. Please <laughs> help <Yeah>. us. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> all right, y'all. We're checking out. Make sure y'all keep the popcorn popping.